In today's video, I want to talk about nonprofits. Nonprofits differ from for profits in many ways, one of which is how funds are received. In a for profit, funds are received in exchange for sales. But in a nonprofit, funds are received by donation without any hope of anything in return. So, especially in nonprofits, we want to make sure that we're thanking those that donate money to us. However, in a nonprofit, oftentimes the thank you letter process is separated from the accounting. And it's such a manual process that it becomes extremely time consuming. So, too often in nonprofits, the thank you letters are not being issued out on a timely manner or at all. So, today I want to show you how you can use the template settings inside of QuickBooks to automatically generate thank you letters and print them out at the time that donation deposits are made. This makes it a lot easier to issue them out, a lot faster, and there's less likelihood that those thank you letters will be forgotten. For today's example, we're going to be using the Create Sales Receipts option inside of QuickBooks to receive the deposits for our donations. So if I go into one of my donors, this is Phil Anthropist, and I look at one of his sales receipts, just out of the stock QuickBooks, when you go to print this donation or sales receipt, give it a second to print here, it's going to look very much like a invoice. And it looks a little bland. So a lot of people don't use these. But with a little tweaking, we can turn this around and make it something useful. So let me show you an example of one of these sales receipt forms that I've altered to create a thank you letter. So this is the thank you letter that we built inside of QuickBooks. It has our name and logo, it's got the information of the donor, and then it pre-fills this letter with the donor's name and the amount that they donated, and lets them know that we're grateful for what they've donated and how we're going to use the funds, and then it's signed by the executive director. So, this took seconds to build out of QuickBooks, and can be easily constructed um, by you and saved, to be used over and over again as a form letter. So let me show you how that's done. Inside of QuickBooks, when you're in a transaction window like the sales receipts, if you're in QuickBooks 2013 or 2014, then you can come up to the Formatting tab and find Customized Data Layout. Now if you're in 2012 or earlier, the Customized Data Layout is still there. It's just not in a tab format like this. You'll have to find it in the menus up at the top of the transaction. So we'll go into this and into the Layout Designer. Now in the Layout Designer is where we're able to design and create all of our custom text which becomes our letter. So we've added the logo, we put in our header information, and the information of the name and address for our customer, which were already fields that were included in the other one. We just moved them around a little bit so they fit inside of these blue dotted lines which represent windowed envelopes. Um, I also took the date field, made it a little larger, and stuck it in the upper right corner like a standard letter. Then I added some custom text to build my thank you letter. Custom text can be added with the add button by adding a text box. I created dear as a text box and then included a data field with the name of the customer. That data fields can be added with the add box and then it shows you a list of all available fields for this particular transaction type, a sales receipt, and you can see we found a customer name. So this field got added here, and then I added another text box with this line of text, followed by a data field that listed the dollar value of the donation. Now I didn't want this to look forced as a letter, so I arranged my text in such a way that the dollar amounts for the donation fell right before the carriage return. And that way it can be as short or as long as it needs to be without having any unnecessary gaps afterwards 
because the next line of text is on a different line. I then continued with the rest of my letter and for the signature it's just a simple text box but I've gone to this font button this also takes just a second to load but that font button allows us to modify the font so I change the script of the font to make it a little more cursive-y that's even a word um, added bold and grew the font size a little so that it looked more like a signature and that's really all there is to it with a little bit of time to add in your text move things around and organize them so that they look beautiful you can have a really nice professional thank you letter that's really just a highly modified invoice but it does the job of pre-filling in all of the data so that whenever a donation is made before saving the transaction you can easily come up here and print the thank you letter and mail it to the donor or if you receive a lot of donations at once you can actually save them to print later and print all of your thank you letters in a batch and send them out to the various different donors which makes it a lot easier to manage that thank you letter process since it's being pre-built uh, automatically by QuickBooks.